Good afternoon, everybody. It's Coach Brown here to discuss the gap down linebacker blocking scheme. It's a very simple scheme where each offensive lineman is responsible for that gap, depending whether it's their right gap or their left gap, depending whether they block down or block out. It's a very simple concept. So the first thing that I'm going to talk about are the rules, okay? Gap down linebacker. Exactly what are we talking about? Okay, and I pointed this out here. In between the center, which is the X, and the guard, that is known as A-gap. Between the guards and the tackles, that is known as B-gap. Between the tackle and the tight end, that is known as C-gap. Outside the tight ends is known as D-gap. So when you're talking about the gap down linebacker blocking scheme, the first thing that the offensive linemen are responsible for is that gap. Whether they blocking down, reaching, blocking out, whether they blocking to the right or blocking to the left. The first thing that they are responsible for is that gap. So for example, if this center, and I'm looking at it going to my left, if this center in the offensive run play has to go left, the first thing that he checks is his gap. Okay, the first thing is he's responsible for is his gap. So that is the first thing in the sequence of gap down linebacker. The second term to gap down linebacker is down. We will refer that to down defensive lineman. Down defensive lineman. So all defenses, whether it is a 3-4, a 4-3, a 4-2-5, a 3-3, a 3-5, a 3-5-3, a any defense that you talk about, all the defensive fundamental of the athletes are responsible for a gap within that scheme. Everybody's responsible for a gap. So after the gap, now we check in down. We refer that as down or down defensive lineman. So this is a nose guard and a gap, a one technique. This is a tackle, a three technique, who's responsible for B gap. This is a strong side DN. He's responsible for C gap. A weak side DN is responsible for C gap. Okay. So, for example, you check your gap. Say the center on this play has to block right. The first thing he's responsible for is his gap. The second thing he ch checks for is his down defensive lineman. So this nose guard is in his gap. He's responsible for him. If this guard has to block to the right, there's nothing in his gap. There's only two things that can be in your gap, either a defensive lineman or a linebacker. So the first thing we check is gap. The second thing down is, is a defensive lineman in my gap. Okay. The third thing, the third thing would be linebacker. Gap down linebacker. So the first thing we check is the gap. What gap are you responsible for? The second and third thing we check for is down, which we call a down defensive lineman, or a linebacker, okay? Gap down linebacker. So let's say this center, center and guard, we both block and right. We both block and right. The center is responsible for this right A gap, okay? So he's responsible for the right A gap, gap first. The second thing he's responsible for is who is responsible for that gap. Well, it's a nose guard. So he goes gap, down. Let's go to this guard. The guard's responsible for this right A gap, okay? Right A gap. The first thing he does is check his gap. Is there a down lineman in his gap? No. Well, there must be a linebacker responsible for the gap. It is a linebacker. So remember, a very simple sequence in a blocking scheme when we're talking about gap down linebacker. The first thing the linemen, or offensive linemen, are responsible for are the gaps. The second thing down they're responsible for is the down defensive lineman. The third thing is a linebacker. So if they know where to step, if they know what gap they're responsible for, there's only two things that can be in that gap, either a down defensive lineman or a linebacker. The blocking scheme is set up to block them which way they are supposed to block them, okay? So a simple blocking scheme. If you have the whole offensive line, we call this our power, a whole offensive line is going to block to the right. The whole offensive line's gonna block to the right. Well, who are they responsible for when they block to the right? We'll go from right to left. This tackle checks his gap, he's got a down defensive lineman. This guard checks his right gap, he don't have a down defensive lineman, he has a linebacker driving him out to the right. 
this, this center. He checks his gap. He has a down defensive lineman. He's going to drive this nose guard out to the right. This guard checks his gap. He don't have a, he does not have a down defensive lineman, so he has a linebacker. He's going to block him down, run him out of bounds. This tackle, he has no he checks his right gap. He has a down defense lineman. He's going to pull. He's going to block him. Excuse me. He's going to block him down and drive him out. Gap down linebacker. Very simple productive blocking scheme. Simple to teach just for the simple fact you have a gap and there's a defensive player responsible for that gap and you block him opposite to where the play is going. Thank you.